Hello, it's your boy from 1996 for another episode of Low Standards. In this episode, we'll be tackling Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, which I got for Christmas. Surprisingly enough. I didn't ask for the game for Christmas, but my cousin got it because, you know, he needs someone to help him with trading and also because, you know, this was the Pokemon game I grew up with as a kid. Like, in terms of legitimacy. I used to play Emerald a lot on a cert on this multi cart my cousin owned years ago, and my first Pokemon experience in terms of not of the actual generation was um was Colosseum and XD. This was the first one I actually experienced playing through the main line from start to finish. Oh man, just looking at the screen it feels so nostalgic. There we are. In this episode, I'll be mainly going through um, dealing with Team Galactic within um, Eternia City. Then afterwards, I'm going to go ahead and do some digging. Because I haven't done it in a while. Well, I've done it at all today. Well, tonight, really. Specifically, in the, in the recordings of this episode. Oh, there. Hey, you! Yeah, you, traitor! Er, it's okay, never mind. You look tough. Uh, I will, um... I'll, I'll let you keep your Pokemon. Carry on. Okay, so there's an area gonna... Oh, hello there! Oh, it's everyone's favorite champion. Oh, is that the Fanatic Rookedex? Oh, my, hold on, I read that wrong. You must be helping Professor Rowan. What's your name? Oh, okay, right now, I'll be sure to remember that name. My name is Cynthia. I'm a trainer just like you. I've been studying Pokemon mythology lately, just out of curiosity. Here in Antonia City, there's a statue of an ancient Pokemon, according to the myth. It's extremely powerful Pokemon. Who knows? You encounter something like that during your reach your Pokedex? I do have a mysterious mythical strong Pokemon. Have you met my Mew? I have a Mew. Yeah. Oh, wait. oh, thank you for the TM. Way in your bag. Oh, it's a cut. It's cut. Hope you take out the field. Accessible. Fill in your Pokedex. All right, let's see here. Two bucks to me. We want your Pokemon. Okay, that's that's a great advertisement there, guys. Oh, look, it's the Dialga. We were in the Dia once created brought time to being in laughter and tears and the same time flows. Such is the thing for Dia. It takes very legitimate and is faded completely in pieces. Dia. Kono <laughs> Dia! No, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, uh, let's switch to Pokemon. So my team mostly consisted of Bidoof and Schmertz, my Bidoof, which I've yet to get an Everstone, Sparks, Delia, Alexio, Kyle, what, with uh, Monferno, Retreat, my Alakazam, because my cousin traded with, with uh, one of his Pokemon so I can uh, evolve him into his uh, so it's my little form. There's T Carpenters, which is the Carpenters, but you know what, okay? And then there's Power Starly, I'm Staravia. No, yes, yeah, Staravia. <coughs> But you, you understand the name, saying, like, Alright, this tree is shaking slightly. Let's see what Pokemon. Uh, okay, let's see what we got. Oh, this is not a shaking tree. This is just a tree I've already done before. The last Pokemon I encountered here with the, with the uh, honey slider tree is, um, was a, uh, was, um, dang it, what was it? Oh, yeah, Wurmple. I don't know how to forget. Well, but you have health cut. I realize now that you can still make your Pokemon an HM slave, but uh, that's not really required anymore. Just everything will help you out, and it's always a Bidoof. I assume that I have to keep my Bidoof, but I um, guess not. But I'm keeping my Bidoof anyways. We're gonna go enter the old chateau to see if we can capture Rodom. Rodom, I realize now it's no longer a legendary, or was a legendary to begin with. Alright, I realize I can't really capture any Pokemon with my current step, with my current Pokemon. Gonna swap him out with uh, Kyle. What? Kyle? What? And I realized I can't really knock down Rodom due to Rodom being um, specifically. Well, actually, dang, I can't. I can't use. Um, I can't use Bidoofish Fritz to catch him because he's uh, Rodom is a um, is a um, Ghost Electric type, and I can't use Thunder Wave because he's an Electric type. My cousin was in this place for a long time trying to capture a Gengar. He never got a Gengar, but in return he got um who got substitute? Nice. He got um 
she got a uh, a shiny haunter. That was a quite surprise to him, and he's had a shiny haunter ever since, which I own because I own one of his old copies. Alright, so there was a late little girl or someone. There was someone here that was haunting the place. So let's check each room and see. Ah, here we go. Alright, so I think I have to go back and solve the area again. I believe this is the TV that has the road on in it. Alright, let's see here what we're gonna do. Let's move forward. I don't know what level the rod arm was gonna be at. I got red plate, but I don't own any ghost type Pokemon on my freaking thing. Oh wait, I gotta click the red plate first and then go back to the room and then the rod arm should spawn now. Or not. I still need to go around the old chateau and find out where I need to go. Let's see what we got. Okay, there's another item. There's an old gateau. The food thing. Alright, I'm gonna go downstairs and see what else is here. Oh, we got a Pokemon. Let's see what we got. It's Ghastly. It's a wild Ghastly. Unfortunately, I would be cat. I would, well, I would catch it right now. I apparently. You know what? It's awaiting your direction. It's okay. Uh, I caught a ghastly back in the dark cave area that I found in the underground, because the underground is significantly a lot different from um, the underground back in the original generation of the DS. As they now have areas specifically for Pokemon to spawn in which you can catch. Pokemon of which you cannot not really catch originally in the main game or in Platinum back then in the DS. They had specifically, I guess, to add more variety of Pokemon catching and also to uh, spice up the uh, underground in general. Let's see here. I got another gas layer. How I wait. Alright, let's go burn him. Take that. Okay, let's see here. So I need to head up stairs now. I think now that I have the old gateau, I now should be able to uh, deal with the... Not deal with, uh, able to catch the run on now. Freaking these ghastly... Alright. Let's go on flame wheel again. I don't want to use any more stronger attacks because I can just... But, um, whatever. Wait, can I go here before I deal with um, the Team Galactic Tower, or do I have to go there first before I can deal with Rhoda? Oh my god. These freaking ghastlies. Put uh, Kyle what in first, due to the fact that uh, he he's the most like leveled up Pokemon in my team. I'm gonna switch to uh, Power possibly. You know, power. Like 